So today I've got uh, an update to the awesome miner. <clears throat> I've been mining on Zpool and on uh, Hash Refinery um, with not a whole lot of success. Um, so here you can see what my miner uh, or what my overclock is. You can see what I'm mining uh, and what my uh, total mine per day is, um, which is pretty good uh, considering I'm not mining with the CPU. This is just my two 970s. <coughs> um, by the way, the 970s, uh, both of them run, uh, take about 450 to 500 watts, depending on the uh, algorithm that you're running. But anyhow, so I've been mining to, uh, to Z-Pool, and I mined to Z-Pool for like, I don't know, we'll just say, for instance, 36 hours. And uh, right now I have uh, four zeros and then a 5.8 BTC, uh, which is... Pretty pathetic. I'll show you guys. So, I started noticing that something didn't seem right. To begin with, um, the miners were reporting for like Zcash. Uh, the miners were reporting really, really high numbers. Uh, why is this currency website not working? Well, let's just do Bitcoin because now we've got that fixed. BTC. So we have that many Bitcoin. So I've made a dollar four in 36 hours of mining on Zpool. Now Zpool was telling me I was making like $10 an hour. So if that was true, then that would mean I'm getting, or ten, uh, $10 a day. Uh, that would mean that I'm getting about a tenth of what I should be getting according to uh, Awesome Miner. And since Awesome Miner is a third party, it doesn't actually have anything to do with the mining pools. It just reports what uh, whatever you have it set to as far as whether it's based on Coin Wars or if it's on what to mine. <clears throat> so that's as far as I know how the algorithm uh, or how the uh, performance per day works for that. But as far as it goes, when you're mining to Zpool, you're only going to get about a tenth of what it says. Uh, I think Zpool scamming, I, I, I don't know what else to say. You know, if somebody can prove me wrong or show me what I'm doing wrong, or if there's something wrong in my settings, but I'm, I'm seeing it all over Reddit. Uh, tons of people are reporting a tenth of what they should be getting on Zpool. So I'm done mining to Zpool. I hope they get their act together because uh, this is pretty pathetic on their part. They're going to fall apart because of this. But uh, so, and then. You can see that Zpool, unless you specify that you want Bitcoin, it doesn't give you Bitcoin. I'm going to show you guys real fast how to uh, make it where Zpool will pay out in Bitcoin. But if you notice, the wallet addresses are different. It's because it won't pay you out in two different coins at the same time. So you have to get a different wallet address to get paid in Bitcoin. So um, here's uh, some more of the days of mining, but this is in BTC, so worth about 1 15th of what, uh, what Bitcoin's worth. Uh, so or BCH rather, this is BCH, but uh, I was pretty disappointed with my Z pool. So then I, I started mining on Hash Refinery thinking that, well, it automatically pays out as BTC, uh, so we'll give it a shot. And I made 53 cents mining all night long. Uh, so I started at about 12 o'clock at night last night. <clears throat> and, you know, I don't know why it shows us like this, but the it, it was I mined during the evening with this last night, so uh, even their charts aren't right. Uh, but anyhow, so I made about 53 cents in 12 hours, which is not very good. When I was on Nice Hash, I was getting three dollars and fifty cents to four dollars. So this ain't cutting it either. Uh, Hash Refinery, their website looks almost identical to Zpools. I don't know if there's something wrong in their code or what. If it's just displaying less than it should be. But uh, since their websites look so darn identical, I, I think that they're probably running on the exact same code. Um, and so they're both having the exact same problem. So I'm done with Zpool and Hash Refinery. Now, Mining Pool Hub is looking pretty good. Uh, um, well, let me pull those two back up real fast. Well, at least. If, yeah, new tab. Bitcoin. New tab. All right. So, 
you can see here I have point four zeros and then a five and then on this one I have four zeros and then whatever if it someday loads four zeros and a one so uh, not not real good numbers there whereas on mining pool hub I only mine for maybe two hours and I already have point zero zero four with a bunch of pending now I did just let this run for about another hour uh, while I was out getting dinner um, and uh, this uh, the Mona coin the Z coin and the uh, grotesque coin uh, uh, are all relatively new there was one that hadn't converted out um, it was in the credited for auto exchange but uh, the Bitcoin number here was the same uh, so uh, at a couple hours on this uh, I think I'm pretty pleased that means I made about you know 50 60 cents in a couple hours uh, here let's copy this paste it in here so it's gonna be a little less than a dollar and we'll just say at the most uh, I, I was mining for four hours uh, it would we'll just say six because four times six is 24 so if I mine for six hours and made 81 cents uh, mining on mining pool hub uh, that would be um, four times eight which is thirty two three dollars and twenty cents that's a heck of a lot better than either one of these two fools are paying out so as far as I'm concerned Z pool and uh, hash refinery are both scams uh, don't mind to them they're they're just stealing your money um, like I said I, I love for somebody to prove me wrong or show me what I'm doing wrong because I, I could use some more of that ten to twenty dollar a day uh, mining you know uh, but <laughs> I just don't believe it there there's a reason that you know you only mine four dollars or so on uh, nice hash I, I don't think they were stealing that much money for us from us at nice hash so that's that um, if you do know what you're doing on mining pool or uh, you think that you, you you just like mining pool for some reason your buddy told you it was the best um, I'm gonna show you how to make it where it will pay you out in BTC instead of BCH uh, so you go down to your Z pool um, and then under this clan line parameter you put in negative P space C equal to BTC capitalized BTC um, and you put that in there and that will uh, make it where Come on, Steam, go away. That will make it where it shows up like it was uh, for me here at Zpool. But like I said, you have to switch your um, Bitcoin uh, receiving uh, wallet uh, names because it, it will not pay you out in two different coins so that's that part of this um, for those of you who didn't see my first video I'll show you real fast how to set up awesome miner so if I click here on new miner um, it'll bring you to this the same exact window uh, when you first load the program but you just click next um, I'm doing the manage profit miner this one here will uh, you can connect like a, a if you already have another program running um, it will run that same software it's just gonna monitor it the manage pool miner uh, is just gonna run one algorithm uh, and monitor it the managed profit miner is gonna run any algorithm as long as it's profitable for you uh, it's gonna try to run the most profitable um, and manage that miner for you the network scan will uh, pick up any Bitcoin mining rigs or any rigs that you have on your network and monitor those. Uh, so that's what those three do. We're going to go to Banish Profit Miner. Um, that's what almost everybody does. Uh, you're going to give this a name. We're going to call this uh, example. Ah, whatever. Good enough. Um, I have NVIDIA GPUs, so we're going to go NVIDIA, click next. Uh, all right, that's all good. New miner pops up. And then you go to options, go to profit switching. And like you said, I'm, all, I'm mining the mining pool up. Nice hash has been hacked, they're not online. Z pool is a scam you're only getting one percent of what it says you're getting 
Uh, this website doesn't even come up when you click on it, so I don't know what to tell you on that one. And a hash refinery only pays you one or ten percent of what it says it's paying you. So I'm done with all of those. So uh, if you're following my guide, you're going to go to miningpool.hub. Um, you're going to register your worker, and uh, to do that, you, you, it's just whatever your username is plus dot one. Um, unless you make another worker and then it, it's going to be whatever that worker's name is plus dot one so the dot one is like the key part um and it, it's real easy to uh set up a miner on miningpool.hub um if you just go to miningpool.hub and then i'm already logged in but you would click create an account um and then uh so you, here you can see my workers this is the one that i made when it came to um uh to the when it when it told me to set it up originally it told me to make a account so uh that's what i did but uh in the end i ended up just using my name dot one um i was reading somebody else's setup thing and that's just how that happened I'm messing around with this uh i have it set to the widest variety uh so uh, it's really up to you guys. I, I don't know what uh, what you per se want to do, but uh, I have it set to the widest variety. Um, so then you come in here to balances. Balances is just like your wallet, but it, it's from all of these different pools. Uh, so these are just a bunch of different pools. So if we go, for instance, Mona Coin here, uh, right there, and then I can go to wallet. And you can see this is what it owes me um, and it'll automatically process it and eventually it'll show up in my Bitcoin portion and then if I click on manage wallet it shows me my account balance um, and payout to can send withdrawals to the address uh, at left box so you just put in your payout address there and uh, that's all there is to it as far as I can tell um, and like I said, it, it's it's mining a lot better for me. Um, what other little things did I learn? Um, supposedly, one of the problems on Zpool is if you have uh, this one in uh, NIST 5. Uh, supposedly, if you turn it off, you'll mine normal again. But <laughs> I did not have that happen. So I think that's a crock. Um, let's see. What else have I learned to, to, to do? Um, I set up my Coin Wars API. I just was trying the different ones to see if it made a difference. It didn't seem to make a whole lot of difference. External miner pools. Um, let's see. All right, so I showed you all the online services part. Okay, so the profit profiles, um, <clears throat> there are the algorithms that you're running based on uh, your benchmarks. So after you get done running your benchmarks, you click save, um, you run the benchmarks right here tools benchmarking uh, the fast benchmark is really really fast um, and then uh, you're just going to save that profile and that will uh, make it where it's going to um, try to perform the best it can for you let's see here on the main menu it has the awesome miners website uh, check for updates stuff like that it did just update yesterday um, I thought there was something else in the options that I was supposed to show you guys but I Cannot seem to find it. Advanced. Oh, um, okay. So this balances part, you can put in uh, the name of it, of whatever you want, and click add. So if I click it, 
coin. I had this set up, but I reinstalled Windows. So let's just set it up right now. Okay. And then I think you put in I'm not going to mess with that for the time being. Oh, that's the other thing I was going to show you. If I go to Profit Profiles and I click Add, um, you can scroll down here to CPU Miner. Click OK. Yeah, that's the only thing there. Click OK. And... Click OK here. And so for the example, I'm going to go to Properties. And then go to, instead of NVIDIA GPU, oh, I was supposed to label that. Uh, cancel. Options. Profit switching. Edit. CPU minor click OK click OK and then if I go to properties I can go to CPU minor click OK and then click start and see what it does and it crashes um, my virus protection goes crazy on it no matter if I turn it off or not um, I'm so I'm still trying to figure out how to set up the CPU miner completely but that's, that's how you do it in awesome miner and if it doesn't give you crap well then wonderful if it does then uh, I, I've still got to figure out how to point it towards uh, the miner that uh, nice hashers using because that miner worked really good for my CPU an extra 30 40 cents a day so it's free money. It's, it's more money than I've been making off of Zpool or uh, <laughs> Hash Refinery. Um, so um, I just wanted to bring this update to you guys. Uh, I think this should have cleared up some of you guys' confusion. And uh, I'm sorry that uh, I didn't know on the last video that <laughs> that Zpool and uh, Hash Refinery were garbage. Um, so like I said, somebody prove me wrong. Somebody show me what I'm doing wrong. I'd love to know. But uh, as far as it goes, uh, you guys, um, I, I I hope uh, I've shown you at least it's a little bit better to be mining on miningpool.hub. Um, I'll bring y'all an update video in a couple of days. But uh, yeah, um, thanks for watching. Like, and, like if you liked it, you know, subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.